What's up guys, welcome back to Tech Games UK. Dan and Ollie here today we're going to be playing Payday 2. We're going to be doing a mission called Firestarter. And if you want to ready up a minute Ollie. Okay, okay. As you can see we've played this for quite a while because I'm 58 and Ollie's 56. And it is a very, very good game. And I would you'll... highly recommend you get it out there. And guess what guys, I'm not ill anymore. Good. <laughs> uh, are we going loud? Uh, yeah, just go straight on in. But, uh, um, basically, guys, Firestarter is a mission where we rob weapons from a load of, well, bandits. Pretty much, isn't it? Yeah. I'm rolling out of my uh, Magnum. Right, I've got my C4 set, so I'm going to blow these lorries open, okay? Okay, yeah, I'm just grabbing the guns from up top. I will chuck them down. Uh, where else are they? There is actually people over the road, by the way. Yeah, uh, basically, it would have been good if we explained a little bit about this. But um, basically, the fire start mission, you have to um, sneak into the airport. We didn't really sneak. We just come straight on in and shot the fuck out of everyone. But you got to steal the guns. You have to steal four bags of them. But if you go greedy like us and take them all, they're worth, like... 100 and something K each. Something like that. But the there is... Difficulty. The higher the difficulty... Yeah, the I was just worth. about to say that. Um, there is different difficulties for this. And... Fucking... Still bagging the weapons. Are you still bagging them? It does get a lot harder. Got another three in there. Oh, uh, police assault. I was just about to say, there's SWAT. Shit. It's the only problem. I'm wearing light armour instead of my usual... Heavy, so I yeah, can move the bags heavy. quicker. But I'm wearing heavy, so I can bag and take a beating. Because a police assault normally comes into the um this warehouse. Yeah. So or this hangar. It is a bit of a pain in the ass, but it's better on. This is a very good game online if you're into multiplayer games. It's definitely worth playing. It's all based on co-op, which is which is actually a very good idea. Um, that's all the bags I can see. I'm gonna start moving them around as well. I just got the fuck shot out of me. Only I'm problem, yeah, because like I was going to say, if you're online, um, other people will take the place of um, Chains and what, Hortex or whatever the fuck his name is. Because the downside with um, the NPCs on this is they can't carry bags. That's why it's based for multiplayer, because then all of you can carry a bag as such. And move them quicker, but oh well. I've been moving them to the hill, and the other thing is, what is pretty good about this, um, the police will take the bloody bags off you so yeah if you do leave them unattended they will take them they will confiscate them always a pain in the ass but it makes this a hell of a lot more fun i'll get the bags to the front of the warehouse okay yeah okay i'm moving them along let's say at the moment i'm using i think this is the ak something on there because there's two types of this gun but I managed to get the attachments because every time you complete a mission, you'll get a like it'll go to a set yeah, of deck of cards. You get like a card and you flip the card over and it'll give you a bonus. Yeah. So that's how you unlock masks, colours, emblems, and all that other stuff. I will apologise a minute. My dog is squeaking a fucking toy behind me. <laughs> so all I can hear is fucking. Uh, taser coming. Yeah, I need to move him because I've got no ammo. That I'm just going to to take that bloody toy off of her. I can I can hear it right now at the moment. You give me some cover. Give me one second. Okie dokie. Even better, I'll just chuck it out of the room. Nice work. Shit, I need to get oh, an ammo bag down. We got shielders. I'm almost down. I'm almost down. You're almost down? Shit. Yeah, we got shielders by me as well. Crap, I'm out of ammo. I'm down to pistol. As I say, so I just deployed an ammo bag where I am. I'm just reloading. Give me a second. I'm coming round to take shielders out. Okie dokie. Right, the shielders are down the far end where our fucking bags are. Okay. I swear, now we're recording it, because we've done this mission so many times, there's not usually many rioters. No, there's not. But now there's Especially on this difficulty. Just still got that toy. <laughs> nice. Sorry? We apologise for that, guys. Yeah. I do apologise again, but... 
It's the only problem with having a little puppy. All he wants to do is squeak a fucking toy and chew everything. Also, the funny thing is, she never squeaks the toy when you yeah, want her when, to. When, yeah. I was gonna say, when you don't want her to, she'll squeak it. I was going to say, guess what she did the other day, Ollie? What? Fucking, I come home, and mum's in this foul mood, and I was like, what's wrong? And she goes, your fucking dog is at the heel of my boots. I was like, what? And she showed me, and she'd ate the entire heel off of it. Well, to be fair, you could tell it was going to be a face like thunder, because it's never a good idea yeah. to uh, destroy woman's shoes, is it? No, fucking hell. I got that in the neck, so I've got to pay for a new pair. But yeah. Nice work. It's not good at all. Right, all of the bags are here, aren't they, Ollie? Uh, yeah. I'll start running them up the hill. Uh, can you place an ammo bag up the hill? Yeah. I got one shot. Okay, give me a sec, I just need to pull out in the van. Oh, they're only worth 71 grand. Okay, uh, well, this is because we're playing on normal. And you think about oh, it, the yeah. higher the difficulty, the higher the pay. Because we were doing this on overkill before we recorded this. We're getting, was it 212,000? 298. No, 290. Yeah. And that was with a team of four of us online. Ollie, SWAT coming for the bags. Are they? I have to get ammo first, I'm just reloading. I was going to say, that was with a team of four of us. And we were playing with, what, level 90s, I think it was? Well, it was 160 and 190, I think it was. And the funny thing and is... That was still difficult. Fuck off my bags, bitch. The real funny thing was, um, we were actually doing better than what they were. The level 90 <laughs> went down about 30 bloody times during the match. Nice. What are the... Um, Oh, dozers, aren't they? There's a thing called a dozer on this. What a very, very, very heavy geared up police officer. If any of you's played Call of Duty, it's pretty much the jug. Yeah. But they're called a dozer on this, and they are very, very well padded. And the only way to right, take them right. down... Okay, the only way to properly take them down is to shoot the visor amp. Oh, shit. Yeah. say, they're a proper pain in the ass. Or just throw a mass amount of grenades at it. Yeah. Has that worked, actually? We managed to throw four of them at him in the last match. Three, three of them. Only three spawn, I remember. Oh, yeah. Sorry, three even, then. Lost. There's one more bag down there. Shit, Ollie, we got shit. There's two more bags, even. Mm, fuck off my bag. Shit, it's time to move. Uh, we got to clear them first before we can go. As they stop the van. Ah, oh, bollocks. Because what's quite good about this, guys, if there's people near the um, near the thing, near the van, sorry, you won't escape. You'll have to. Uh, you got to fight well, them off. You'll have to defend them, wait for more. Right, I'm going for it. Well, you just have to wait for the van. Go for what? Getting in behind the shoulders. They're after me now. I know. I'm trying to come up in behind the shoulders. There, I turn the shoulders round. Right, let's get out of here. Let's go. Let's go. Well Okay, guys, if you've liked that episode, please like, comment, and subscribe, and stay, stay in tune for the second part of this. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye. Subscribe. Next. Previous.